So, welcome back to Steve Home Spawn on YouTube. In the background, you see Devon Green, a new talent, very sweet, very beautiful, very young, 18 years old. And this was her sixth or seventh scene we shot together. Uh, it was a new experience for her, and we're gonna talk about uh, that in an after the scene interview. And uh, before we go to this, that's what uh, the main topic is today, I want to read some questions I got. And the first one, our typical question, what I always tell you not to ask me. So it's, what's this movie is it? What is it called? What is the movie called where you prefer me the sex store? Please don't ask me these questions. I don't know. I'm shooting a scene and then I go home. I don't know how they're going to market the movie later, or what's going to be the label. Okay, look it up. There's Google, there's International Adult Film Database, there's other sources. Look it up. I don't know. I'm just fucking. <laughs> okay. Um, have you ever been to Thailand or have you planned to holidays in Thailand certain days? No, I haven't. I heard it's beautiful. Many of my friends have been there. Uh, but I travel mainly for work and my favorite holidays are staying at home. And I never had a job in Thailand, so maybe one day I'm going to be there. Then, do you like to be rimmed and do the girls always do it? I do like to get rimmed and people think, I think people can tell when they see it in my movies. But of course, we're not always doing it. It's uh, it would be uh, boring if we repeat the same thing in every scene, first of all, second. Not all, uh, every director likes it, not uh, every girl likes it, not always the situation is good for it. So it happens now and then and I enjoy it. Um, why don't you do a plaster mold of your red cock? Because I don't have a toy company. Uh, if a co toy company ever calls me and contacts me and offer me decent money to do a dildo shaped like my dick, uh, I'm open to it. Then uh, another question which is typical, uh, <laughs> I hear it a lot when it says, can you perform with Katya Kassin? Yes, of course I can and I've, did, I've done, but it's not up to me and it's not up to Katya, uh, who, if a producer books us together, uh, yeah, I'm sure. Well, she enjoys it, we get along very well, and I would surely enjoy it. So, how do you respond to people that speak against porn? Usually I don't. I mean, some people like it, some people don't. Some people like horror movies, I don't. Whatever floats your boat. Um, you should uh, do a kind of solid gold which scenes have been your most remarkable no actually I shouldn't <laughs> because um, the scenes which are especially remarkable for me as a performer are not necessarily the most remarkable scenes for you as a viewer because um, sometimes uh, uh, the situation on set in the positive as in a negative way is totally different than what comes out and uh, maybe my best scenes from the viewers perspective is not the ones I enjoyed most or vice versa and since I don't watch my scenes I don't know so I cannot really recommend anything it's better if you check uh, the internet there is a lot of reviewers doing that professionally they watch and compare movies and scenes and do reviews and they give you a really good idea if you're looking for something special so uh, uh, -bum. what's your favorite sex toy Romulus is asking um, I don't have a favorite sex toy because I don't use sex toys sometimes I do it in movies because it's part of the story but I don't use sex toys in uh, my re real life my personal life uh, I think that the best sex toy is 
presented as a beautiful face and the whole girl that's that's more than enough <laughs> okay uh, then have you stuck your penis out of your pants accidentally at a restaurant uh, not that I know of maybe it happened one day without me noticing um, have you done many golden shower movies with women uh, I've done a few not many um, and again please don't ask me the label or where it's released or the name I don't know uh, I've done a few scenes uh, with golden showers uh, in my life and I like it uh, it's not done much in the US uh, most companies don't allow that they have uh, limitations and it's not actually a legal limitation as far as I'm aware of it's more a distribution limitation some credit card companies wouldn't process payments if there is golden showers involved some distributors wouldn't distribute the movies so that's why most companies in the US don't shoot it and of course it's a niche market anyway so I've done a few scenes uh, not many but you probably can find it don't ask me where there's Google for it um, does Marika have a YouTube channel same thing there's a search button on YouTube look for it um, please make a video with Kenna James with pleasure as soon as a producer calls me books me I do read all this, sir. It's not up to me. I'm the talent. I'm not the the, the one who, who does the bookings. Do you think of working as a producer after your retirement? Uh, first of all, uh, I wouldn't call it retirement if I'm still working. Uh, and second, I've produced a lot of movies already. I mean, maybe not a lot, but over 100 and uh, some of them are um, uh, available uh, to watch and to download and to stream at the Evil Angel page you just type I'm gonna put it here you just type www.evilangel.com slash en for English um, slash movies slash Steve dash homes and you get a list of of these movies which I produced and directed and you can watch them and then I produced and directed a lot of uh, scenes for kink.com for the their website under the king umbrella it's called public disgrace so check them out I hope you like them and I think that was the last uh, oh uh, an, an interesting kind of uh, funny question can you get STDs when you buy a porn DVD that is rented and a guy checked off and touched the DVD first of all look my introduction video where I ask you don't ask me medical questions I have no clue I never thought about it. I think that's that's a funny idea that you you rent or buy a DVD and then catch STD even though I don't think it's possible but I'm not a, uh, a doctor or biologist or whatever so you should ask somebody with this education uh, if you really want to know it I've never heard of a, such a case uh, but it's, it's a funny idea to think about it so you never cheated on your wife or whatever all of a sudden she you get an std by jerking off to porn yeah i don't think it's possible but who knows so anyways we are here and look in the background this beautiful long, young girl devon green uh enjoy the interview with her after our scene for new sensation digital sin Hi Devin. Hi. So would you say your stage name? Devin Green. Hi Devin Green. <laughs> so you and me we just did a scene for New Sensation. Yes we did. We finished about 10 minutes ago, 5 minutes ago. Yeah, I'd say that. And um, 
you are very new to the business. I am. So I'm sure you're gonna have a lot of fans who know who you are very soon. <laughs> but <Hope> right so. <laughs> now, not so many people know you. Not yet. So let's introduce you. <laughs> okay. Where are you from? I am from New Hampshire. New Hampshire. Mm -hmm. uh, I've never been there. You know, I'm, I'm from Germany. Mm -hmm. uh, but I heard it's very pretty. It is very beautiful, especially during the fall. Yeah. Uh, is it called Indian summer when they have that all this colorful leaves? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's I, really beautiful. I heard about it. Yeah, I want to go there one day. It's gorgeous. And would you say you're a typical girl from New Hampshire or are you an exception? I'd say I'm a typical girl from New Hampshire. Oh, then I have to go to New Hampshire. <laughs> if there are more girls like you, I will love it. <laughs> because you're very pretty and so Super cute. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and what is your age? How old are you? I'm 18. 18. Yep. So you didn't wait too long. No, I didn't. <laughs> so what did motivate you to start doing porn? Um, I just didn't really like where I was in my current life position. Well, not current anymore, but I just wanted to be able to go on a crazy adventure and that's what this is for me just being able to have fun and fucking make money and go different places and just explore so it seemed like a really fun career path for me <laughs> i tell you what i do porn longer than you are alive yeah uh, i and uh, i can guarantee you it's a fun place I, you can travel a lot. I shot in 21 different countries so far. That's crazy. And um, a lot of new experiences. Yeah, that's what I want, so. Uh, let's talk about new experiences. Like today, I think, was a new experience. Yes, it was. <laughs> so what, what did we do to, with you today? So today, basically, I got tied up and spent banked a lot with various <laughs> instruments <laughs> instruments yeah uh blindfolded like so you got yeah spanked on your ass spanked on my ass tits, tits thighs pussy like <laughs> and got spanked face a lot. slapping oh and a little bit of face slapping too that's true and we got this kind of needles on roller oh on your, yeah on your body and on your nipples mm -hmm. yeah that was nice <laughs> it was nice you liked yeah, it yeah i did like it <laughs> I, I told you you will at the beginning you said stay away with that <laughs> i didn't know what it was it had needles on it it looked scary yeah and i told you relax you're gonna like it <laughs> and i liked it you were right <laughs> <laughs> it's always also depends a little bit how you do the things you yeah can do it more light or more painful it's depending yeah. on like some girls enjoy pain, yeah. so then you can like, push it harder. Yeah. So, but that's the fun thing about all this BDSM stuff. You can you can adjust it and play with it. Yeah, exactly. So yeah, new experience. Uh, this was scene number seven in your life. Yeah. Yep. And you already did a scene for new sensations. I did. Your that second was second scene, I think. Yeah, it was <laughs> my second scene. So, um, so far you have not so many scenes to look back to. Not yet. Only about two of my scenes have been actually released at this moment, but soon I'm hoping a bunch of them will just start coming out. No, yeah, this is good for your reputation and for your fan yeah. and everything, but I'm talking about your personal experience. Oh, um, okay. uh, how would you say what is the percentage uh, of the scenes where you really enjoyed the sex and where I mean sometimes the scenes are hard to enjoy because it's yeah. so much set up so much this and yeah. that and sometimes uh, it's more relaxed and you yeah. can enjoy so what would you say was the percentage of scenes where you said it was not just a great job it was also great sex hmm. Prob I mean, I've only done seven scenes, so probably about, I don't know, 
three out of seven at the moment. I'm not sure if you're a really, really good actress or uh, if it was real because today I felt that your pussy was very wet <laughs> and I had the feeling that you came for real. But maybe you just acted very well. I did. <laughs> I did come a couple times, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. I, I, I hope so because I was like, wow, mm. this girl, either she's a great actress or <laughs> she just came three times to <laughs> So <laughs> I, I'm happy uh, because it's always fun when, I mean, I had a great time, you can yeah. tell, but it's easy that an old man like me have a good time with a pretty young girl. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I'm happy that you also had a good time. I did. And I'm very much hope that we're gonna shoot again. Maybe some other scene where we have a bed or a couch, yeah. a little more comfortable. <laughs> yeah, instead of a t teeny tiny chair. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that'd be nice. So, is there anything you would like to say to your future fans? Uh, because when this is released, probably you already have a few hundred, but later maybe a few hundred thousand. <laughs> Anything you would like to say to your fans? Mm. Thank you for supporting me and following everything that I do. And where can they follow you? They can follow me on Twitter at Devin Green XXX. Good. Yep. I'm gonna uh, put a little um, uh, sign in the movie so they can just type it up. Okay. <laughs> so Devin Green XXX, I thank you very much. I had a great time. I wish you all the best for your career. Mm, thank and you. And I hope to see you again on set soon. Me too. <laughs>